welcome to the Seminoles.com Daily Report for Tuesday, August 25th. I'm Lane Hurt. After two days off, the Seminole football team returns to the practice fields this afternoon. One unit expected to be a little more focused than usual is the wide receivers. That's because at the kickoff luncheon on Friday, head coach Bobby Bowden publicly challenged the group to step their games up. So when a man with more than 380 victories and a pair of national championships speaks, you tend to listen to what he says. challenge that uh, Coach Bowden gave to the wide receivers, I'm like, it's kind of like once he said that, I, I didn't hear anything else besides the challenge. So I'm actually taking this challenge personally. That's what I took from the luncheon. And I just want to make the fans happy. I'm sure all my sad mates want to make the uh, fans happy. And I just want to um, step up to the challenge that Coach Bowden uh, presented us. The preseason honors continue to roll in for linebacker Dakota Watson, who was one of 35 players named to the Butkus Award watch list on Monday. The Butkus Award is given to the nation's top linebacker. Watson was also named the best defensive player in the Atlantic Coast Conference by SI.com. Don't forget Seminole fans for all of your Seminole football updates, including practice reports, photo galleries, and all-access interviews. Log on to Seminoles.com, join our Facebook fan page, or follow us on Twitter. With volleyball season beginning on Friday for Florida State, one player in particular cannot wait to get started. Senior outside hitter Mira Jurek missed all of last season with an injury and will return to the court for the first time against Central Michigan. Jurek is expected to be one of the top players in the ACC and to say she is excited to be back on the court would be a little bit of an understatement. I really don't think there's a word in English that I can explain it, but like waiting a whole year and a half to play is something I never want to do again you know and I've been playing really really hard the whole spring and whole summer trying to get back in shape like trying to get back in like hitting shape and stuff and I just can't wait to start that first match they better watch out. <laughs> Finally a reminder to all Seminole fans that there are still good seats available for the Labor Day game against Miami. For tickets visit Seminoles.com or call the number on the bottom of your screen and student registration for student tickets has begun so make sure you go online and sign up for your seats. Have a great day.